This is gonna be my base set, jungle, and fossil master set collection. But right now, it looks like this. I've made it my goal to have a complete master set of the first three English Pokemon sets that were ever released. So that would be base set, jungle and fossil right now we have an empty binder but don't worry we've recently got some packages with vintage cards inside that we are going to be opening today and as you can see this is a big boy so we are going to open this up and see what is inside if you're a returning viewer welcome back to the channel i appreciate you and if you're new welcome to the channel Today's goal is to see how much progress we can make on a jungle base set and fossil master set. We've got over 400 cards today that we're going to look at, all vintage. We're going to see how far we can go. Okay, so guys, this first package that I have here is a collection of base set vintage cards. They should all be from base set. We're going to open this up. There should be about 60 cards in here. Um, I got this for about $25. So uh kind of a good deal i don't expect any hollows or anything but we should be able to get a majority of our commons and uncommons and maybe even some rares some non-hollow rares first i gotta figure out how to open this okay here we go we got the goods by the looks of it they are nicely packaged let's throw that away all right i guess uh we do have some stuff in top loaders. Those might be some good cards. I don't think they're gonna be hollows, but we will see. All right, guys, so my plan is to go through these cards and uh, I have a spreadsheet on my laptop right here. And I'm just gonna find cards, make sure I got it tracked down so we can see how much progress we're making. If I see anything good, I'll stop and point it out for you guys. But uh, here we go, we're gonna get these. Oh, what the? They just gave me a top loader and no. <laughs> There's nothing in the top loader. All right, we're just gonna go ahead and just keep, just, just, just go, man. We're just gonna go. Got some trainers. Okay, very nice, very nice. They're all unlimited, it looks like. They should be all unlimited. Got a lot of trainers, okay. All right, let me get these in the books. We got, mm, this might be almost all of them. got those all in the spreadsheet we are looking good we are making so much progress it's like I'm getting all the cards in order some of them are missing but like we are doing really really well so far on base set and I do like that this person gave me nice sleeves for each of these cards so now we're gonna go on to the second stack of cards let's just make sure are we anything good any first editions any shadowless I, I, I highly doubt it some uncommons. We got some rare trainers as well. Okay. Let me get these in real quick. Okay, guys. So I just put everything in the spreadsheet. Did, some, did the calcs. We have 55 cards out of 102 from the base set unlimited collection so we're more than halfway done already most of these are commons and uncommons which is what i expected but like man just looking at these is so nostalgic these cards like oh my gosh i remember when i was a kid opening these didn't give a crap about them but now they actually mean something they're very special to me and I will treat them like my little babies. Also, something I wanted to point out, we, we have all three base set unlimited starters now. Looking at them like this, it just looks really, really cool. I remember these artworks from way back when and like looking at them now, it just means a little bit more. Okay, so we're done with that small package now. Now we're going on to the big boy. This is someone's vintage collections. There should be more than 300 cards in here from what I remember. So we're gonna take a look and see what's inside. We got a, we got a nice thank you note with some cards inside. I'm not sure if this is a bonus or if it's just whatever I was supposed to get. 
Here it is. We got a nice binder. Whoever sent this did a really good job. I mean, they protected this very well. And they even gave me like a really nice binder to go with it. I have my own binder that I plan on putting all these cards in. But it's nice to, nice to add a binder if I ever need one. So before we get to the binder, let's take care of this little pack of uh, cards here. I'm, I'm guessing this is a bonus because it wasn't included in the, uh, the main folder or the main binder. If I can get these out without damaging the cards. There we go. All right, definitely not vintage. All right, let's quickly go in. Let's just go through these and see, uh, see what we got. So we got a fairy energy, okay. We got a, a Larvitar, what? 2018, okay. This is upside down. These, uh, I think these cards are just kind of thrown in here. Like this one is beat up, look at this card. Got Chikorita, so we got some uh, Gen 2, some Gen 2. Don't, I do not know what these are. This is base set, base. Oh, we got Lieutenant Surge's Spearow. All right. We got Rocket. We got Rocket's Secret Machine. This is from base and that's from base. Okay, that's kind of cool. I mean, that's I guess that's a freebie, so I appreciate it. Okay, so now we can take a look at this binder. This binder, oh my goodness, it's heavy too. This thing is like full. So we got base set two, we got some base set, we got some jungle, and these cards also look like they're in pretty good condition. I'm guessing once they were put in here, they never left. Wow, this is pretty, this is nice. I don't know how he organized it. Man, we got a little bit of everything here. We even have some Rocket. There's a Rocket Ekans. I apologize. I didn't even notice. Let me bring this up. We have some first edition jungle cards. We got the Meowth. We got the Venonat. We got Goldeen. And we have the Bellsprout. I don't see anything crazy, but uh, some good stuff in here. We got, now I guess we're off. We're on to the trainers now. We got base set trainers, we got jungle trainers, we got fossil trainers. Okay, that is perfect. That is exactly why I went for this. It was a, a good deal and should take out a lot of what I'm looking for. We got energies for days. Energies for days. These are all, these are some base set twos, which I mean, I'm not going to be complaining about that is that is the whole binder. This entire binder is filled with vintage cards from jungle base set fossil base set two. There's some rocket cards in here. I mean, this is nuts. Now it's time to start logging stuff and uh, let's see how many cards we can get, uh, how much progress we can make on our collection. I was going through the binder, I was taking out the first edition cards, and I looked at this Meowth, and I noticed this right here, and then I was like, oh, that doesn't look good. And then I turned it around, and look at this hole in this card. Bruh. And I also noticed uh, the whitening on here is, it's worse than I thought. I looked at this, didn't even notice that, it looked actually, it looks really good. But uh, yeah, I don't know what happened here. What's up guys, it's voiceover collector Sky here. I just wanted to say that I moved over from my laptop to my desktop so I could have more room while I look through the binder. Anyway guys, if you're enjoying the video, please consider giving a like, a subscribe, or even commenting down below telling me that you enjoyed the video so I can make more in the future. Ladies and gentlemen, we have all of our cards sleeved, top loaded, organized by set number for each set as you can see we have the majority of our base set we have a lot of work to do in jungle and uh same thing with with fossil we don't have very many cards no hollows for sure so now it is time to start filling this book up 
Okay, voiceover collector Sky back here again. So this process, putting all these cards into the binder actually took a really long time because if you've ever used binders before and you've ever missed a space and you're trying to get all the set numbers in order, you gotta take all the cards out and put them back in. It is such a pain in the ass. I messed up two times and I think at some point in this clip you can see me pulling out all the cards and moving it one space. It was really freaking annoying, but uh, yeah, eventually we got there, um, and uh, yeah, you're about to see what the binder looks like now. <sighs> All right, guys, after like an hour of putting these cards in, we finally have everything in, in order. Take a look. All the commons, this is base set. We have almost all the commons and uncommons. It's getting a little sparse here. And we have all the trainers, almost. And that is the end of base set. We have a lot of work to do in jungle. There's almost nothing in here. And then this is this is where Fossil's supposed to be. <laughs> Not much going on. This page is almost completely full really great to see all these vintage cards where they belong in order I mean this is nostalgic I don't know about I don't know about you guys but this just kind of gives me tingles when I look at them they're just uncommons we don't have any hollows but I mean it still looks it's it looks amazing I can't wait for this to be completed that's that's pretty much it for the video guys um i'm definitely going to do part two and three however many videos it takes for me to get this complete anyway i hope you guys had a good time watching the video if you guys want to see more content like that let me know in the comments down below otherwise i'll see you guys next time peace